everyone, and we'll today's starting rap video. So yeah, like I said, I previous reaction at at the very end, I was gonna react to another particular video or specifically a teaser trailer uh, to something else that was Star Wars related. Particularly, I reacted to the Rogue One, a Star Wars story official teaser trailer. So yeah, this came out like earlier this morning, and I've seen like, a ton of people already react to this. I've already seen like um like uh, a collab like a uh, like a compilation of videos of a bunch of people's reactions to this particular um teaser trailer so yeah people definitely got got onto the bo boat here to uh react to this uh trailer right away and yeah i'm now just getting into it so i feel slightly late but it's still still barely been like more like it barely like, 12 hours has been out but of course everyone else has probably seen it but i am yeah so i'm definitely um i don't know if i'm like uh i definitely i'm interested I'm, I'm not, like, excited or, like, you know, pissed off that the movie's coming out. I'm interested. You know, like, obviously, this movie is going to be taking place between episodes 3 and 4. And, obviously, you know, like, the Rebels going to be formed. Uh, we we'll just get a day, like, how the Rebels got formed in this uh, movie that's coming out on the, like, by, by the end of this year, I think. Well, I think we'll probably see at least get a day, like, when it comes out at the end of this. But, but um, uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what the entire respect to all this, but um, I, I will say I'll, I'll probably go into more detail after this thing, but I did see something that's um, uh, come up slightly co controversial, specifically with one particular character that's like featured in this uh, trailer, so I'll talk more about that after this. But anyway, so without further ado, let's get started. But first, oh, I could reset. <clears throat> Alright, so. Let's react to the Rogue One, a Star Wars st uh, story official teaser trailer here. In three, two, one, play. Okay, I thought here's for truth before we announce this by the MPAA. Alright. Alright. Okay. State your name for the record. Oh, it's like the, it's the same outfits from episode four. Forgery of Imperial documents. Oh. Possession of stolen property. Oh, is part of the Empire? Assault. Resisting arrest. Ooh. On your own from the age of 15. Oh, same one lady. and undisciplined. This is a rebellion, isn't it? Whoa. Oh! I know it's like the classic sword of armor. Oh, she looks like the like the one lady from like episode six. Okay. Okay. We have a mission looks like she's the main you. character. Another female lead. <laughs> A major weapons test is imminent. Oh we shit! We need to know what it is and how to destroy it. Yeah, it starts. Right oh, they're like printing them. Oh shit! Is that clear? Oh, she's so gonna like, like. Fight. Yes, sir. Oh, she's so gonna try to listen to Dad for it. This is December. Okay. Okay. It's just take. Ooh. What will you do when they catch you? Oh, you damn. Do, they break you. Oh, damn. If you continue to fight. Oh, that one dude is killer. I can't remember his name, though. Oh, Ooh, like 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, Okay, looks like this is um like you know latest to other Star Wars latest stuff. But anyways, that was the Rogue One, a Star Wars story official teaser trailer. And again, again, I'm not too surprised. It's, um, it was interesting. Um, definitely a, a lot of, like the um, like the first teaser trailer we got for uh, Force Awakens, where it just showed like stuff, like Star Wars latest stuff. You know, like in the to, like that, that teaser story we saw, so, you know, we saw BB-8, we saw the X-ray flying over the lake there, we saw Kylo Ren, and then we saw like the Millennium Falcon flying around. So yeah, again with this, like, and not showing too much, but at least we're getting like idea of what's gonna uh, happen. Is obviously we had this. Oh, I I didn't catch catch any. I was I was talking about. Sorry sorry guys, but um yeah we got this. At least I did that. This one uh, girl is like be the main character, and uh, that's actually what the, a lot of people are you know pissed pissed off about where again uh, some people are uh, mad that a girl is the female lead uh, for a Star Wars movie uh she's uh, and we just we are we just had a female lead for a Star Wars movie and she was a badass she was a really cool character like Polly like, again like my friends she's like one of the coolest char characters we've seen in a Star Wars movie. Eager play Jesus Christ but uh, um I'm, I'm not gonna do too much of it but again I don't really see why 
I, I was seeing much of it, and like if she was a a guy or a girl or whatever, I was seeing point. She she definitely seems pretty interesting. Where you know, like she was, it seems like she was part of the empire, but now she's like I caught by the rebels, and then they need her help to find the plans for the Death Star or something like that. So I think that's kind of it is kind of interesting that the the rebellion is already formed in this movie. I was kind of thinking like it would lead up to the formation of the rebels. So. So I'm definitely curious how they're gonna explain that or one that, and um yeah we got the like um uh, like I think um like um like it's that one guy in the uh right the white clothes and the white cape that was a cool outfit I think he kind of reminded me of General Tuck from like you know episode four I don't know that could be but I don't know okay something similar they was that like uh, oh like the one lady in the white clothes that I I don't know the life for me like her her like her name in the Star Wars universe but that seemed like a, a younger version of the one lady from episode six you know she was at the briefing to you know before they went to um uh and. Endor there to you know take down the shields there so um so yeah it's kind of cool I think she's you know like one of the head head the uh ladies uh of the rebellion so I think it's kind of cool you know she's she's kind of back for this and then, um you know obviously I think more like a, the the one main chick is got, uh, gonna uh, like infiltrate like the, the empire you know tries uh, I think kind of shows like why she was wearing that particular uh, armor again or uh, I, I don't know it's like obviously I guess we have to wait till December to hear the full story and then, of course I'm not going to read. Too much into it since obviously I don't like spoilers and such. And then we got you got a bunch of like you know Empire stuff. We got to like see the classic uh, stormtrooper outfits like you know this rugged white ones. I saw a couple like scout armors and like the and a new like and then a new like um like black armor or slightly like gray slightly black armor. I don't know the car tone, but that would look pretty cool. And we saw like you know like like four ATATs like march on like this like desert like a des deserty uh area with some like tropical trees and such so i think that's kind of, uh, kind of cool to see and we saw the um one dude talking but i can't for life me who, who he is but i recognize him at least so i know him from somewhere and then um we saw like a uh, uh one dude like about uh, down i don't think i don't think that was darth vader it could have been somebody else i, I don't see too much but um i think also got a couple people mentioned like um there's like like no mention of darth vader so far i wouldn't be surprised he's there somewhere um, hey, hey, hopefully not like a Luke, Luke was in episode 7 where he shows that like at the last like minute so hopefully nothing like that but you know like at least like some mentions or at least like, get like a couple scenes with him you know and then um obviously yeah we're gonna uh, see like the, like the final um uh, with the Empire like a uh, like putting like the fi like the final touches uh basically to the Death Star when you know they were putting the um, the panel there, uh, for the Death Star to, you know, where the laser comes out, so, it was pretty, kind of cool, that, definitely curious, like, what's, like, the, um, specific, like, year, or, like, oh, at what point of the Star Wars time, timeline this is, I would be surprised it's somewhere between, like, like, the half-half, um, waypoint between, um, uh, three and four, since, obviously, what we saw in the trailer, like, like, basically, the Death Star was just about to be completed, at least, like, um, like, the outside wise, or would be surprised on the inside, so we still need to be, uh, worked on and obviously the rebellion was formed the empire definitely looked like they definitely had a bit of a uh, their a uh, bit of a control over the galaxy so i'm definitely i definitely at least at least had to read on or at least look into like at the, like, the specific like, points in the star wars timeline when this takes place uh, and of course i would be surprised they didn't release that type of information just yet May maybe by the time they release like a, like an official trailer trailer for this movie, oh uh, we'll see. Maybe maybe it's how they turn the summer. We'll see it. I don't, I don't know. Well, of course, like Star Wars Day. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, Star Wars Day is coming. Out. That's like May fourth. So maybe maybe on May fourth, which is based like Star Wars Day, like May the fourth be with you. So I'm thinking maybe some maybe there'll be some more information on, on that day. So let's see. Was that um less than, less than a month though. So maybe like a less than a month we'll get some more, like maybe possibly another trailer, um for. Uh, the, uh, for the Rogue One movie, uh, this is a slightly prediction at the moment, but I would be surprised to do do, do something for um May fourth. But um, uh, so yeah, overall, uh, not too much, but obviously, so pl plenty of stuff shown in this uh, teaser right here to talk about. Uh, definitely uh, shown like a new uh, main character. Uh, definitely looks like she has like quite a bit of a backstory. About, obviously, a little more about it in the movie. And of course, we see like like familiar faces. In this uh, trailer, but obviously, like younger versions of themselves, uh, compared to you know, like the original um, movies, and Netflix, some like cool action is probably gonna happen. Um, that definitely, you know, like stuff leading up to uh, episode four. So, so yeah, um, at at the moment, 
Uh, it the movie looks pretty good, and yeah, I'll more likely see it in theaters when it comes out. So yeah, uh, and of course I definitely can't wait to see uh, like a like an official uh, trailer for this movie. So whenever that comes up, I'll more likely react to it. So see you till then. So overall, send this Rex feel. Make sure you like this video, scratch out more videos, and then you comment down below. Such so what video I start to next. And make sure to take a link to my socials and your sites in the description down below. Those will keep up with my next videos and anything else I post. So, overall, that's video. Hope to see you guys very soon. Bye.